Okay, this is just where I came from. So... Ah, oh, Geo. I, I checked to make sure there wasn't a, uh, Fool Eater. Gotta be very careful of the acid. That is what that seems to be, acid. Oh, hello again. Neutral entry. Okay, the game does not pause when you're on that screen, so... I'd best uh, wait until I'm safe to uh, read it. Ah. Oh, I remember seeing this thing. Those who stray from the White King's Road shall face a lot of un. And there was like a lake of un or something like that, right? Coming back to me. I keep mistaking those for the, uh, little, uh, what are they supposed to be, like, caterpillars that you have to save? Used to have, uh, seen better days. What, what is the range on this thing? Uh, apparently it collides with, uh, you know, stuff. Man, I, oh, I could just barely reach it from there. I didn't even realize that it would, uh, be too short. Especially since it closes up whenever I get near it. There's a way over here, so I suppose I shall go this way. Oh god, I didn't see the moss fucker. I best heal. Oh, hello. Ah, damn it, I thought I could pogo on it. Building here. Nothing else around, it would seem. Oh yeah, I recall uh, messing around with trying to get through here without the uh, lantern. You know what that means, uh, the, uh, markers, oh, I'm out of the red ones, so hopefully I can, uh, find a way to repurpose the blue ones before, uh, I have much else I want to check out. Oh, right. Need to be careful of uh, those things. Especially in the dark. This area seems familiar, but I guess uh, it's not the area I'm thinking of. Area down here. Wait, is this the uh, fog caverns? Oh yeah, definitely. I should wait. There, there's a stack station down in this vicinity. I know it. Okay, so these things, these big jellyfish, I've realized since, uh, like, I, I watched my uh, recording that the way to deal with these things is actually super obvious all along, and I had no idea. I, I'm like, I was like mentally kicking myself while watching my past self struggle with them. Cause obviously you just need to hit them in a certain way, and it's fine. You don't need to worry about them, because they're, they're like a little puzzle. Uh, 
Uh, they, they definitely, uh... Like, for sure, they, uh, have, like, a solution for dealing with each of them. Yeah, see? I can't believe I didn't realize for so long. I, I was thinking, like, you know, am I supposed to just avoid them? But they're enemies. That That's, like, such a cop-out. But, uh... You know, oh, God. Okay. That, that one was a bit harder to discern. Uh, yeah, I, I need to be down here in order to hit it this direction. Just make the area safe before I uh, worry too much about that. And bam. Oh, God. Okay, definitely not... Uh... Maybe I'm supposed to be on the other side in order to do that. That feels uh, about right. There we go. Alright, no map. Well, I kind of want to get down here and unlock the uh, stag station, so uh, I'll go ahead and do that. It's so fascinating to just, you know, be going through this area that initially I explored in the opposite direction because I saw the, like, fog area first. Yeah, I got to apply some... Maybe that's part of my difficulty, so it seems like they get... Maybe not always harder, but uh, it seems like, to some extent, <laughs> like some of these are harder than others, so maybe I did the challenges in the reverse intended order or something. Okay, I, I, I could probably do this. Easy. Yeah, it just applies... It just requires some planning. Just requires some planning. Oh. Well, I, I uh, found my way to what I think is probably the bank. Yeah, here we go. <laughs> the bank. Well, I, I'm not uh, super interested in that at the moment. I, I have heard some things about the bank. I, uh... I am aware of the, uh... Well, let's say the concept that the banker is maybe not the most trustworthy person to leave my money with, but, uh... You know. Oh, hey, it's Coral. Is this something? I had not expected to discover so huge a stack station after that foggy descent. That line confused the fuck out of me when I came here from the other direction. I was like, foggy? I, I guess it was kind of like, foggy, I guess. Like, I wouldn't associate that with mushrooms so much. <laughs> the bugs of Hollow Nest must have been an impressive lot, building such grand structures so far into these wilds. Seems the dangerous creatures about haven't yet made their way in here. It's a perfect place for a quick rest. Can you imagine this place in its time? Hordes of bugs traveling about the kingdom. Stag bells ringing, the station bustling with activity and life. Now only our like even know it exists. That's a special thing, I suppose, to cherish these sites, even in their decay. Hmm. Isn't it that, just faintly, you can still hear the echo of the bells? Hmm. Hmm. Fascinating. Why, why do we need a loading screen just for the, uh, <laughs> over here? Hello, I remember you. Oh, come in search of treats, have you? I chance upon a unique little fungus growing right above us. I've only, I found it only in the station and the taste was just divine. This place must once have been quite the hub, built at the border between two lands. That misty drop to one side and those bulbous growths another. Neither place seems particularly welcoming, so while my little treats last, I think I'll stay right here. Yeah, yeah. Feel free to stop by any time. I do like the quiet in this station. A little company is always good for one's health. 
Yeah, yeah. Yep. Sounds good. So what, th this is another area that has the same sign. Okay, this is the room that actually has the stag station. And we'll absolutely unlock this. Just for the uh, sake of having it unlocked. Because I was not able to unlock it last time. Because, uh, you know, the uh, game took all my money. The game bugged me. Ah, uh, this gladdens me. The Queen Station has opened once more. This place was a bustling hub of travel, well placed for travelers visiting the outer edges of the land. You're quite the explorer to find this place. Let's see. You know, I kind of want to go back up and see if there are other colors of, uh, you know, the... Of the uh, markers that I can place. Because that would be nice right about now. <laughs> I ran out of red, so I need to air something else out. I remember there was like yellow and white last time I saw them. No, nothing new. Well, I suppose since I'm here, you know, let me make sure there's nothing else in the other shop I want. Mask shard. Well, I mean, I don't want to lose my money and not be able to get stuff, so why not, right? Mask shard. Can I go back down or to go to Green Path? Maybe I'll just head back to Green Path. In which case, uh, I actually want probably want to go back up here because I don't think I unlocked a uh, stag station in Green Path. So what I actually want to do is head back to the crossroads and go back down. I wonder if any of these other buildings will open up like that one on the far right edge. Those we'll have to see. Uh, I'll refrain from visiting the, uh, you know, like, Caterpillar friends because, uh, that, that'll just give me money and I don't need money particularly this moment. Because carrying it is, uh... Well, only a bad thing, it seems. I could still nitpick about the money system, but now that I'm uh, more removed from the event, I'm uh, less upset about it. Ah, oh, I mistimed it. I don't need to, like, go over and grab the money. It just comes to me. It's amazing. Oh, there's a bench, so I might as well go get that real quick. I feel like this is where I ended the, uh, session last time. Uh, good times. After I went through the fungal waste and, uh, you know, the foggy caverns and, uh, you know, went all the way around. <laughs> I suppose nothing to do but, uh, try to get back to where I was. Have I been over here? I think there's probably Geo here. Oh god. I got impatient. Oh well. Damn it. I'll just come over here and kill, kill you myself. I wonder if you could do any fun skips by uh, bouncing on those enemies in uh, important places. I have heard that, uh, oh god, right, those explode when they die. I forgot about that. I have heard that there's a funny thing that, uh, speedrunners do with the shade by, like, dying in a specific spot and then coming back and bouncing off of the shade. Which sounds utterly hilarious if you ask me. I suppose, uh, I'll, I'll just head over to the left since that's, uh, area that's marked out. Maybe the, uh, Hornet fight is, uh, what'll trigger the map shop to start selling new colors. Oh, God. Ha. Huh. I, I saw you there.
Oh right, I was gonna check the hunters thing when I had a moment. Oh. Uwoma. Smallest gel smallest jelly form, passive and unaware, but pulsing with a dangerous electric charge. And Uma. Passive outer being protecting an aggressive explosive core. I don't think I've unlocked any descriptions because I don't see any like notification dots next to any of uh the entries besides those two. Alright. New area. Ha, huh, I, I remembered you being here. I, I remember this is my first encounter with this enemy. Hang on a minute. Let, let me uh, do something real quick, actually. I was thinking of using my ranged attack, but then I was like, oh, right, I uh, actually don't want to do that, probably. Because I need healing. Ah, new entry. Timid creature that frightens away intruders by covering itself in huge clumps of moss. Not unexpected. <laughs> I'm pretty sure I must have read that because that seems very familiar. Oh god. I, I did not realize there was... Uh, the safe platform didn't extend. I should have looked better. That, that makes it sound like I should have dressed for the occasion. I should have looked better. I should have given a better look is uh, probably a better way of describing it. Why is that there, though? I mean, I'm, I'm immediately suspicious of it. What do you mean there's nothing here? What do you mean there's nothing here? What? Malarkey. Hello again. Oh yeah, there's that area that uh, I couldn't get to before. Well, I, I want to... Uh, oh, right, wrong button. I want to mark this. I don't have uh, a color to do that. I'll just mark it with the blue one. And... Uh, yeah, I... Even if I come back here without actually needing to, I'll, uh... Yeah, I, I should make one here, actually, before I forget to, because that definitely seems like an area I need to be able to dash for. But yeah, even if I unnecessarily come back here after the dash and, you know, realize I can't get there without the dash, or I can't get there even with the dash, at least I'll probably be able to repurpose like a color or something. I don't know. Or maybe I'll have a new map marker color. That'd be helpful. Probably getting close to the Hornet fight. I can feel it in my bones. And also in the fact that I think that icon up there is like the place. Oh, well, my jumps failed two times there. Oh, I, I thought that was like a foreground object for a second. Alright, here's, uh, the money, the, the paywalled bench. Alright. Anything up here? A little ledge. Oh. Uh... Was I, like, hitting something through the floor? Was that not how I was supposed to do that? Yeah, okay. That checks out. Oh, well. <laughs> Damn it. Wait for that to explode before trying to get back up here. 
That seems overall safer. Let's see. Do I want to go this way? I'll save it for later. I want to get me a dash. Because that sounds like a uh, fun time. Having the dash as opposed to not having it. I'm certainly getting better at timing buying those things. And all variations of that enemy type. in here. Oh, yeah. Th this thing. Oh, God. Got it. It's so quick. I, I definitely uh, have some idea of what their pattern is from the previous recording session. Oh, God. Alright, they can attack twice. Oh, no. Oh, no, really? Couldn't do much about that. I was already healing. Oh, well, it's not very far from here, so that shouldn't be a problem. Oh, that, that could have been bad. Oh, got pushed down there. And it's perfectly safe to go up here. Still don't want to go over there, especially when I have more important things to do. There we are. Honestly, this enemy is super easy to deal with when you just bounce on its head. Yeah, honestly, incredibly easy. Moss Knight, protector of the green path, trained in the ways of the nail and the shell. Neat. Uh, I'll check out the rest of this room uh, a bit later. Up here. Hmm. The greater mind once dreamed of leaf and cast these caverns so. In every bush and every vine, the mind of Un reveals itself to us. Is Un, like, supposed to be a deity of some kind? Yeah, that's interesting. I hear... Caterpillar. I don't think I can actually go this way. All right, there's that guy up there. So if I can't go this way, way am I supposed to go? Well, I, I suppose uh, I, I might as well give this uh, marker. Really, I'm supposed, I'm supposed to come from that direction to some degree. Ah, damn it. I think it'd be tricky for sure. For you. <laughs> Easy. You're not the only one who can shoot projectiles. Ha, I, I, I 
realized at the last second that that was there. 